Today, I'm going to teach you the strongest play in 2K16. I call it the Double Dragon. It has an infinite amount of options out of one playset and it cannot be stopped whatsoever, online or offline. The beauty you see in front of you is just one way of running the Double Dragon out of an infinite amount of choices. So I'm hyped, let's get to it. Oh by the way, my name is Sam Pham. If this is the first time you're seeing me, subscribe right now for over 100 2K16 tutorials. And trust me, the play I'm showing you today is mighty strong and I got maybe 10, 15 more of these coming. So subscribe now for those and family. Yes, the double dragon. It is just as intimidating, <laughs> as effective as it sounds. So it's gonna get nasty today. Sit down, relax, get ready, and let's go. Right, the play itself is Fist 91 side. It's a pick and roll ball handler play and you'll be able to find it in the Bucks playbook and also the Nets playbook. So initially, the option is pretty clear. Your point guard is going to run for these double picks. If the drive is there, take it. So nice and easy. Now the second option is the uh, corner free ball. So this is very similar to the 63 fist from last year, but this gets way better. So if the corner free ball is there, also take it. But because of 2K16's improved defense, these two options are not likely going to be there all game. They don't happen often. You can see here the computer on Hall of Fame Sim does great hedge defense and it just absolutely shuts down the first two options. But that's why I'm here. I'm going to teach you with a trick or two, you can actually unleash an infinite amount of options within this playset. So we'll look at option number one, the strong side row. So here, we're going to go through that drive again. Computer's going to shut it down. But the strong side high post player, he's actually going to roll hard to the basket. So all you got to do is hit him and find him for the dunk. So this is already a really good counter, but this gets way, way better, family. So let's take a look at option number two, the weak side pop. So yes, the way this play is set up, the double pick is actually done with both big mans on each of the high blocks. So here, instead of going to LaMarcus, we're going to go to the weak side high post man. That's Tim Duncan. LaMarcus dives in, gives Tim Duncan the J. Mid-range jumper all day long. Alright, here's option number three. I call this the strong swing. So you're still going to penetrate to the side. You're going to hit the roll man, the strong side roll man. Swing the ball to the other corner. Bang! Lure down for the free ball. Option number four, weak side swing. So we're going to use the double pick again, but instead of swinging it to the strong side, we're going to swing it to Hassan white side on the weak side. Other corner, Goran Dragic for the mid-range. This is absolutely unstoppable. There's still more options coming, family. More options. So you can take a look at it here. With both big men in the high post, it's just too hard to guard because one rolls deep into the paint and the other pops out. Hassan swings the ball to the corner. There are also players on both sides of the corner, so there's options on either wing. Absolutely deadly. Goran Dragic, bangity, bang, bang, bang. All right, here's option number five, weak side high low. So we're going to chuck the ball to the weak side high post big, Tim Duncan. There's no jumper, so we're going to call a quick pose up, give it to LaMarcus, call a quick iso. You see, it forced the mismatch, so this is LaMarcus all day in the post. All day. And here's option number six, my favorite, weak side dive. So we're going to penetrate. If the drive or the free ball is not there, we're going to kick it to the weak side big. And as Chris Bot catches it, we're going to hold triangle or Y in the Xbox. This year, if you hold triangle, it leads to a cut. So white side is going to dive to the basket even harder, trying to catch a pass from Chris Bosch. So we're going to check it in the white side, finish it up. That's six options. And from each option, an infinite amount of you know, backup options. So here's the final option. I call it the broken pick and roll. So if you're running the double dragon and nothing is there, you see the cut's not there, I'm just gonna fake the pass, get it back to D-Wade, and I'm gonna run a high spread pick and roll. The defense is shifting out of its mind. So this high pick and roll at the end, high spread pick and roll, is incredibly hard to stop. Here's again, we're gonna go to the weak side pick, no dive, we're gonna get it back to Dwayne Wade, and it's not just about the roll and finish, right? You can also roll and swing again. So we're going to chuck it to Stoudemire. He's going to swing at the Chalmers. Corner free ball. Bang! And this not only works against AI, it also works against humans. Here is a play online game against a user's Houston Rockets. I go to the weak side big. Opposite corner. Corny Lee. Free ball. Same set. This time I go to the strong side big. Good initial defense. 
They kick it back to the ball handler. The strong side pick dives in the paint. Easy basket. Whew. Beautiful basketball. So, last clip of the day. You guys must be wondering, why do I call it the double dragon? Well, in my culture, a double dragon stands for the metaphor of an attack that is so overwhelming, your enemy has no idea how to adjust and how to cope. So this is what this is. With all of the options available to you, this is SamFam's 2K16 Double Dragon Attack. Unstoppable. Alright family, that brings us to the end of the tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Now, I am never one to gloat. I am a tutorial maker. I like to teach and I like to help people win. So, but this play, this playset, the Double Dragon playset, I am 33 and 0 offline and 8 and 0 online because of this. I haven't lost all year because of this. The Double Dragon is just, it's unstoppable. And it's not cheese. You gotta make the right reads. You gotta use your basketball IQ. But once you get into the flow of it, flow of it and if you have the right roster for this playset, this suits a lot of roster. I was using this on RTTP with my all bronze team. So a whole bunch of really bad players. I was still killing it. So the double dragon, one dragon, two dragon, unstoppable. Enjoy it. If you have any got questions about it, comment section, let me know how you use it, how it's working out for you. So give me some feedback and yeah, enjoy your weekend. And yes, use the double dragon this weekend in 2K16 and destroy the competition. Share it. You can let people know. No one can stop this. Knowing it makes it worse because you know it's coming and you don't know which option is coming. Knowing the play makes it even harder to defend. That's the beauty. So have a great weekend. Double dragon time. Destroy the rest of the competition family with this. All right? All right. I'll see you next time.